Wait a minute. Wait. Wait a minute. Yo, 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 yo. What's happening? What's going on, family? Welcome in. Welcome back to the show. Uh, I want to say, man, I just, I seen Felix just upgraded, man. He's been a member to the channel, man. He upgraded, man. I appreciate um, the support. Anybody that becomes a member of this channel, you upgrade to the front of the line of philanthropy because I take all of the money. I don't take any of it to put it in my pockets. I don't buy. If I buy a watch, it will be for somebody else, which I have done in the past. But uh, that money is used for other people and other things, man. Cancer uh, research, uh, helping families, all of that. Feeding families. We've done it, man. I think it was the last uh, last event I had. Uh, I was able to give the money that you guys have used to support uh, a family locally uh, getting started. Just got a new apartment, needed furniture and stuff like that. So I took a portion of my money to get food and other things that they needed and that came from you guys. So Felix, thank you so much. Uh, anything that you guys spend into this channel is going straight out to, to people that uh, is in dire need. And it all started with a watch because we all love watches. We all like collecting. Uh, yeah, you know, it's one of them things. So today, dear watch collector, dear watch collector, man, I'm going to be covering a, a, a number of topics. Today is an open forum, though. Uh, last week we had uh, my man Joe showcase his beautiful, 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 beautiful collection, man. And it just kind of gave us a... Um, a, a, a just a sight, like a look into his world. He let us in, you know, I, and I take that stuff so, like, man, serious, bro, and I don't take it for granted, man. This man let us into his house and walked us around his collection, man. So with that being said, Joe, thank you so much for doing that. Uh, my man, Dad Mods in, in the building. Wow, Fizzle, I see you, Jay Jones, or a.k.a. Repeat. Watchman54, what's going on, Roy? Appreciate everybody that's in the chat right now, those that are watching at home on your televisions and all that good stuff, man. I appreciate you guys. Uh, and I'm going to be showcasing some of my watches today, too. All right, all right, all right. So what I did was I did drop the link. So if you want to showcase your your uh, your watch collection, or you want to be a part of the conversation, man, because we're going to be talking. <laughs> I started on Instagram today, y'all. Oh, but before I get into it, I have on my Citizen Siosa, and you guys wait, because Citizen is going to be the, the talk of the town this week. This upcoming week, I'm going to be talking about more Citizen than anything else, because I think it is such a slept on brand, but yet they are selling out worldwide in the Siosa, this right here i'm gonna talk about that a little bit here uh it is man some of the models that you you're trying to get like this glacier blue sold out in a couple of stores and uh right now they got the small seconds uh watch chris actually covered i don't know i know some of you guys look at watch chris because my analytics tell me that just that that you guys are watching that so uh let's see here who all do we have? You guys are speaking to each other. All right. Okay. All right, ladies and gentlemen, first and foremost, let's do this. I know you guys have seen this guy. Uh, if you are an employee for Invicta stores or anything that sells Invicta timepieces, you have seen this name come across your desk more than one time. I know if you're driving UPS, USPS, or FedEx, you have driven to this man's house. You probably have a key to his box to drop things off. This man buys more watches than A.L. Lalo can put out every day. Please help me welcome to the stage, Mr. J. Jones. First and foremost, good evening, everyone. Happy Easter. Hope everybody enjoyed. Hope the Easter Bunny bought you guys. Stuff like he bought me. Well, he bought me a few things. He bought me this. Wait, wait. What he, bought me, he bought me this. Oh, is that ceramic? Bought me the ceramic for Easter Sunday. 
want me to ceramic I'm and a couple of us. You're stabilizing camera next time. <clears throat> and a couple of us. Otherwise, everything is beautiful. Everything is fine. Everything is great. Okay. Here, we'll do it this way. Okay, there we go. Do it this way. Come back, come back. Right there. Do it this way. Little, little piece, little piece. Nice little piece here. Ceramic. Bought me a couple other things. He bought yeah. me a, he bought me a dive case. In fact, he uh -huh. bought me a briefcase instead of a dive case. Yes. But uh, we had a good Easter. Hopefully everybody okay. else did. Megazoid, what's going on? Trap, we know you had a good we know you had a good Easter because we talked to you early on Instagram. <laughs> I had, you know, I had a, I had a great Easter, uh, and it was really, uh, I'll show you guys. I had uh, spent some time with the grandbaby today, man, and uh, that's always that's always a good time, bro. I, I, I love spending time with her while she was out, you know, walking around picking up Easter eggs and all that good stuff. That's what I want to know. Did she have a good Easter egg cunt? Oh yeah, man. She, yeah. <laughs> I had I had a great time with her, man. <laughs> I had a great time with her. Felix, <laughs> okay. I was one. I was like, "What is going on?" I said, "Felix, you getting dirty?" He was talking about take off the watch. He said, "Take it off." <laughs> I took it off. T tell okay, Felix. Okay. I took it All off. All right. So check this out, y'all. So in in the spirit of this month has been dedicated to a particular. Um, phenomenon if you will right so this man that collects more particular pieces than anybody else known to man and he was coined the king the king of magnums if you will so that's my man it has to be my man the man that the created one only. the entire month to the take away from only. march madness it called it march magnum of course it is it is it, the ah. magnum Vic, yo, oh, I'm leaving. What I'm is up? Worthy. What is up? What is up? What's going on, boys? Happy man, Easter, Magnum man. Vic. Well, just got home from my from my folks. Styling, driving, you know, trap, you know. Ooh, JJ, yeah. JJ, well, I know. Yeah, JJ I know. you know. I, know. I, know. I, I can't see chat. Good to you. Yeah, I can't see chat because I'm on. But so, hello to everybody. The Easter Bunny was good to him, trap. I saw. I know. I, saw the I, know bunny. I know. I already know. He got. Yeah. I already know. <laughs> I already know. Yeah. So what's I, up? What's up? <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Hold on. Hold up. I gotta put this. In. <laughs> what you say? <laughs> I gotta go. Vic is here. <laughs> uh, <laughs> he, uh, he, Felix, got Felix, he got you. That's bro. gotta be Felix. Felix got me. Felix, my boy. He got you. Yep, he got yep, you. Yep. 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 So, gentlemen. Gentlemen. Um. Today on Instagram, and I know you guys, some of you guys were on Instagram, so I just want to like go over this real, real, real quick. Um, today's episode was really inspired by a number of things. Um, I watched TGV's episode that he dropped the other day about that uh, Squale. Uh, I watched, uh, watched Chris. I listened to a couple of collectors. Jay Jones, me and you talk. I talked to Dave D. Vic, me and you talked about collecting. And mm -hmm. I think across the board, um, most people that's even in the chat right now, you're pretty happy with the collection that you have, right? Um, yeah. There's no no rhyme or reason. It's just, you know, everybody is doing what they want to do. But here we are in 2024, and I call it the year year of um, of a, a exposure. Man, people. <laughs> hey, bro, hold up. Wait, this is a, a friend of mine that lives here, bro. If you pay more attention to the YouTube you would know that I was live, bro. Why you calling me? And I'm calling you out, bro. You, yeah. Uh oh. So, <laughs> so, 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 yeah. He's a, he's a good friend of mine. Um, Easter Sunday, he's calling people out on Easter Sunday. You know, Ooh. right? Listen, I'm just, Ooh. I'm saying, this is the year of exposure, man. Uh, Cat Williams came out here and said a lot. People went crazy behind that, and it has went rampant. Even to like, oh, uh, I, I watched a video with, um. Nico, Nico called out uh, Rick Ross. I didn't like that. 
I didn't like that, you know, from, from Rick Ross, because Rick Ross showboating and doing what he does, which is his business, but like there's a different vibe when it comes to watch collecting. And Nico jumped all over it and it became more of a it, it, it's foolery. It's foolery on both ends. And it's like everybody got has to hit headlines talking about somebody else. But then when it starts trickling down to I saw a comment that somebody sent me today. People are irritated with your collection. They sure Who's are. Collection? And I'm like, with JJ's collection? But no, with your collection, Vic. Not mine. All the magazines you got, all that heat. And you say you say all the time, you got you don't have any heat. Look, Trap. look, right, look, right now, the only heat I have is in my garage. That's it. Well, that's some that's big heat. Oh, that's that's big heat. <laughs> <laughs> that's big heat. Yeah, if the I, chat doesn't know, uh, I purchased a new vehicle yesterday. It was unplanned. It just happened. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, it was totally unplanned. I mean, I wasn't hey, going Trap, there. That's like me buying watches every day, unplanned. Mm -hmm. Hey, like, hey, hey, I'm going to put you in timeout, sir. Because you, yeah, you time out. You're different. You're my different. Oh, so he can go out and buy a, 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 a new vehicle on a whim. Like it I wasn't a, well, like I, I, like I buy watches on a whim, but I shouldn't say it was on I a whim. I was planning on buying a CPO. Now, people in the automotive business, a CPO is a certified pre owned. Mm -hmm. uh, my car, you know, was reaching 100,000 miles. I didn't need a new car. And then things worked out, and it worked out. And I yeah, got a, like, like got I got a, like I work out with my watches. Got a new car. Man, I, I, tell what, I tell I you what. I tell you what. Y'all, y'all, y'all table left for a second because I want to introduce a man that has a collection that's second to none that I oh, am that. so proud of because he got some heat. He got some negative heat in his comment section because he is bothering the algorithm. He is bothering the souls of men and women across America right now because there are certain watches in his collection that they just do not jive with, right? So please welcome to the stage, man, the original Kevin Nash. Big sexy, my man Ripsaw Joe. Yeah, yeah. Oh, <laughs> mm. Hey, hey Joe. Yes, hey Joe, what you doing with that gun in your hand? Dun, 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 Coming dun. after you, man. <laughs> hey Joe, wait a minute, Joe. I'm, I'm just, I'm just kidding, Jerry. I'm gonna say something, Joe. I love that thing that you did with your collection and everything like that. That's why my collection is up in smoke right now, it's burning because I can't keep up with you. Oh, stop. <laughs> oh, no, God. If anything's up in smoke, it's your credit card or whatever. Exactly. You to to purchase. Exactly. <laughs> so you can't That's compare, JJ. See, you can't compare me yesterday because I walked away out of that dealer. I didn't put zero down. I wasted no money out of my pocket. My payments, the same as it was on this car. So win win. Win win. Uh, and I, I, I have to give out a I have to give out a shameless plug to Jake at Trifecta. That guy is the real deal, man. He took care of me again yesterday. Well, first time yesterday, but if you guys are essential, talk to him. What what's that? What'd you get now? <laughs> It's a secret. <laughs> Why is he laughing? Wait, wait. Wait. Why are you I'm laughing, Joe? Just, it's I'm a collect. secret. To, you, I, you can't I know about it. Citizens, citizens Blue Angel. Oh, see, so Trap enabled you to get that. See? See, he has Trapatine. That's Emperor Trapatine. What are you talking about? Trap Dude, enabler. Number Dude, one enabler in the world. I, te I texted Jake, and I actually placed the order when, it, when I was texting him back and forth. And he, <laughs> he texted me and says, did you mean to order that one or the limited edition one? Yo, Leo. I said, oh, crap. I meant to order the limited edition. Can I cancel this one and order the right one? He says, no, I'll give it to you for the same price. He basically Ooh. took a hundred bucks off. Okay. So right then and there. And it was only because I knew Trap. So thank you, Trap. <laughs> no problem. Hey, hey, Emperor Trapatine strikes again. That's it. Yeah. That's it. So let's 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 have let's have this conversation uh, among brothers among brothers all right and and anybody that's watching this man um I know that I said this on Instagram earlier 
I have people that's watching the show that can comfortably get a watch under a hundred dollars, right? I got some people that can buy watches that stretches above twenty five thousand, right? I've, and I've sat with you guys and had conversations, and we've actually right. looked at watches together, right? So there's a a difference in disposable income between people. Let's get one thing clear. Um, I would never make you feel uncomfortable, uh, no matter where you are. And I would never take for granted uh, that, like, if you don't have the spending cash for it, if this is, I'll show you something. If this is all that you can afford, this right here cost me $14 on Amazon. And I like this watch. I work out in this watch. It's a 33 millimeter Casio, dang near indestructible. But about, and yeah. if that's as much as you can get, you shouldn't feel bad or think, well, I see a guy that's going by the $20,000 watch and I can't get it. Who, Jay Jones? You know what? Would you <laughs> ask yourself this question? What would you do with it if you did get it? Is that your is that your taste level? Yeah, but I couldn't wear that watch every day. It's like no. it's, it's 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 like you got to look that Casio. It's like the Digitex. It's the same. Okay. The Digitex and the Digitex and your Casio you just saw are about the same watch. You can wear that every day, and if something happens, you ain't worried about it. So well, Trav, I, I mean, just got another, just got another got, comment while we're talking. I just got another comment. It came I'm from the real it. Sam Dallery. Now, this is for my I, uh, the Gladiator Spartacus I posted on Instagram the other day. Mm -hmm. Cool $10 watch, bro. Shit's ugly as fuck. <laughs> Come on, man. Spartacus, $10. Joe, I thought it was a buck, not two ninety eight. dollars for that Spartacus. You put that on your IG comment, Joe? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll answer it. I'll answer him back. I'll, I'll take care of him. Huh. But, but you oh, know what? Let's, let's look them, at it from this standpoint. Um, Because somebody, like, and I'm glad you brought that up, Joe. Uh, somebody left a comment here and mentioned that you evict the people, go out and buy these watches that's worth pennies on a dollar. And then you showboat and blasted this that and the other let me tell you what is and i can't even say the american way but this is across the world there's product out here that you buy that's not worth what you pay for it it's exactly. just not that's just what it's it true. is it's true yeah. there's a bunch there's a bunch i mean think about this here here's something that people did for a long for years decades cable tv think about how cable was set up you had the program. They they were sending the box out to you. You rent. You didn't buy the box. You rented the box. And if you kept your cable provider for ten years, you realize that you pay for that box at least three times over. It's you know not what more. And they don't or, give or you anything. More. So and you don't get anything back for that. When Xbox came out, the Xbox three hundred and sixty. That was able, they had the capacity uh, capacity of running your cable to it, so you could use that as your cable box. You could go to Best Buy, you can go to Walmart and buy a natural cable box and just have the cable man come out and run it from the pole to your house mm -hmm. and to your box. Easy peasy. But you've wasted money. There's things that you've wasted money on for years. And, yeah, but and Joe talked about this. Let's talk, let's talk about this. And this will never be put to bed because it's just an ongoing topic. Invicta compared to Rolex, there's no comparison, first and foremost, because Invicta was created back in 1837 to be an affordable Swiss made timepiece. That has some, I mean, they, they still keep, kept the same premise, but when AL took over, his watches are more like he came up during the hip hop era, you know what I'm saying? So those watches are flashy. And he, it still works. It obviously works because Invicta is still a company that's producing over 5,000 watches per year. Now, if that's not your taste level, that's fine. But when you're still comparing the, the Submariner, the Rolex Submariner to the Invicta Pro Diver, stop it. I, I, all I'm going to tell you is this. I don't see how that watch is $12,000, $14,000. The marketing is amazing. Mm -hmm. That uh, me and Joe, we we talked about that. The way they market that watch is amazing. I don't see where it cost, why it should cost that much, and why you should even concern yourself. 
I mean, the Samaritan not, may not even be for you. That may not be a watch that you want to have. Because I'm going to say this, honestly, I think that the Omega dive watch looks better than the Submariner. All right. Here's, a, here's another one. <laughs> on the, on the uh, which one is this for? Let's see. This is for the Sub Aqua Noma 3 I posted the other day. Comment from Toy Story 8833. Looks as cheap as it is, he says. <laughs> And then there's another one on the Gladiator. <laughs> this is trash. Horrible design. Okay, whatever. Hey, Joe, are you public on your Instagrams? No. He got to be. That's on Instagram, yeah. You got to go private, bro, and you won't get those messages. <laughs> I don't care. They can stop it up there. You know what? I really don't care. You know? yeah. hey, I'll, get hey, it. I'll, Joe. I'll respond back. Trap hey, knows. You know what? I, I bet. I bet. I put money on this. I put money on this. Because this, this was actually a, a, a proven thing. If if let's say for instance uh Audemars Piguet made the same took bought that design. Let's say they bought that design and they put it out. They put their own movement in it and they put it out the same watch. Same watch but they had instead of putting an Invicta on there, they put Audemars Piguet. Guarantee you they'll still have some people complain about it, but they'll buy it at a higher price. They'll oh, yeah. be like hey this watch is $30,000. Guarantee somebody will buy it. Hey, hey, look. I was away two weeks ago, right? You know how many Invictus I saw on people's wrists? So I wanna, you know what? People can people are gonna ben just gonna hate. Was, was it five, 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 eight out of ten, maybe? I mean, it's just enough's enough. I mean, it's not even I mean, the guy puts up a post up and he's proud of his watch and he's gotta get nasty ass comments because people in mom's basement with Doritos crumbs on their five hundred pound chest. They don't know what else to do, so you know they got to go ahead and, and, and make fun of people's people's watches. Well, Joe you know knows, I mean? Joe knows yeah. how I feel about when he posts a watch. I think he's full of crap. You know. <laughs> <laughs> See, Joe, it's really JJ in, in code. He's incognito, right? Incognito. Yeah, he's incognito. Joe, wait a minute. You know how I feel about your your collection and when you post and stuff like that. Because you do the same thing with me. When I post, you, you make a comment, you put a like or something like that. Vic with his magnets, we may joke around about, oh, here we go. Here he goes again. And Vic, I know what Vic's talking about, but Vic knows what I'm talking about. Oh, here he goes again with them daggone magnums. <laughs> <laughs> That's well, hey, we I want to let but, you guys know we have, uh, we've made the list. We have one uh, Flawson CEO, Representative Tony White. The people's Ooh. champ is watching us right now. Ooh. Uh, so Ooh. I just want, hey, thank you out there. Can we do uh, the polls. Lawson family, I appreciate you watching. That means a lot when you do that, man, because I know you got so much stuff going on. And the fact that you took time to watch your boy and you got all these other fine gentlemen, well, two fine gentlemen in uh, the police up there. Uh, appreciate <laughs> you for watching. Thank you so much. Thank and you. that is all. Thanks, Trap. You know, you know. Hey, like you know I what? Said, since, since I'm a, you know what? I'm going going. to expose you, Jerry. You keep it up. I'm going. To, I'm going to do just like York. Cat Williams. I'm expose you for who you Don't are. Don't come to me. I'll let you know right now. Yeah, I got seven watches in yesterday, and a, and and a dive case. So don't come to New York. Okay. See, <laughs> now I, I I wasn't gonna say this, but I'm just gonna have to put this out. Since 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 all these people are dropping bombs and the P Diddy stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, let me just tell you first and foremost, you're hearing it live now. First and foremost. You want to know. know why Jay Jones is able to buy the watches? You're like, he must have a great income. He was a dirty cop, man. Look how many times <laughs> he did bumped a lot of people. <laughs> he was robbing <laughs> drug dealers. He was kicking in doors. It was like, wow. hey, if you don't want a wow. rap sheet, you better I give me it. all your money. So now, I knew it. I knew it. now he had to sit on that money for a while. He had to sit That's on right. it. You know what I'm drug in money. his retirement. Drug money. Huh? Drug money. It, it, that's it's why not, well, it's, it's not drug money anymore. You know what I'm saying? Like that's it's right, stolen it money. You use your badge. And he, he told Bro, that's that. why when I pick up JJ from his house, I pick him up. We go to Yonkers, whatever. That's why people run away from my car when they they say no JJ's in it. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I knew it was something. <laughs> I'm just listen, I'm, I hate to be the one that have to expose you, Jerry. But <laughs> enough's enough. I'm sick of this. <laughs> And that's they go why, running. They and go that's running. Why you can't come to New York anymore because you're gonna get it. See, see, listen. 
If I come up missing, y'all know it's Jay Joe. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's coming up. He's coming up, man. You got to go to the barn, man. JD's got to come back to the barn. See? Oh, Look we lost it. Joe. Joe, uh, Joe, will be back. Get, man, get that badge out of here, man. Get that out of here, bro. This is a this is an anti badge type of situation. Look at all, look, 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 at all them, look at all them cases back there against this wall. Ooh. It's listen. It's drug money behind them cases, man. Oh, wow. wait a minute. <laughs> Let's go this way. Wow. It's drug behind that, man. Go this way. J. Joe, you sure you're not you sure you're not in Times Square's stock room right now? For real. There is no more Times Square stock room. Yeah, it's great because it's in your house. It's, it's in my your house. house. Right. <laughs> yeah, you walked into that one, sir. You walked yeah. into that. Yeah. And that's all right. Yeah, things are good, gotta, man. Hey, look. And let you me know. tell you another thing. I got another 18 slot. Ugh. It's coming in. And another seven watches coming in on Wednesday. Mm. This guy, this guy, this guy, trap. I, it's I, all I, because I, of I, trap. I don't know. Uh, so it's all I, because I of trap. To, I do want to let you guys know this upcoming week. If you follow me on Instagram, uh, Vic and I will be doing a theme week. Uh, Vic and I want to just confirm with you today. We're going to do uh, inspired pieces. So what kind of pieces, pieces are we doing? That either came from somebody or you got it because of somebody. Right. So in other words, let's say let's use the Disney watch you gave me, Jay Jones. That would be considered yes. That type of that type of watch that we're posting. Yep. Mm. Yep. Like oh. okay, like mm. the gladiator is that Janet Trap and DK conspired to get me for my birthday. Mm. That exactly. that can be that can be posted up. Mm. Exactly. My birthday so, present from my birthday present from Dave D. That can be posted up. Mm -hmm. So we're doing that for a week. We're gonna do that for a week. My her this heritage right here, this came from Kenny. So yeah, I wouldn't have had that without him. You know what I'm saying? So like that, that'll be a watch that goes up. Right. You know, mm -hmm. so right. And then the following week, I don't know what I'm gonna do yet. Maybe blue label week. I don't know, maybe X. I'm, I'm doing all blue dial watches the following week. All blue ooh, dial. Ooh, okay, yeah. we're gonna do that next that, week. Blue blue so dial that watches. Includes, that includes like, right. the, I, like all like the Robin. Yeah, Robin, yeah, yeah. Like, any all that as, as long as it's blue. blue Long as it's blue. So I do that. You, may, you may see that one. You may blue see dial. this one right here. I could do that. Plat like platinum, blue. Platinum, but blue. Not the strap. Not blue. the strap, but it, not the strap. The, dial. the dial's got to be blue. The dial got to be blue. The dial got to be blue. Any color blue dial. Blue yeah. abalone. Blue abalone. Oh, man. Jay Jones, look. That's not going to. Look, Jay Jones, amongst your 900 watches, that's not going to pose a problem for but you. That's a problem for me. Oh, Is here we it? go. Not really. You, you know what? Funny, funny you should say something about blue, though. My son called me this morning and told me his boy is looking for a watch, silver watch, with a light blue dial. I sent him a picture of Aragon with the light with the Robin nest egg. Mm -hmm. I got a couple of uh, Hydro Maxes with the, you know, with the blue dial. Right. I have a couple of couple of ones he sent he sent it back and said well where the heck you get them stuff boy where you get that from i told him exactly what to do he was happy to see it because he don't see they, they say they don't see watches like that okay well, i, I want to ask you and something I wanna, they're, they're I wanna... and they're they're in georgia but i said well, go to invictus store i told him go to invictus store you can Let get me, jay, jay jones i'm gonna start with you because you're running your mouth <laughs> um and I'm, I'm gonna ask all you guys i wish this. i wish it was after effect because i have something for you man once you get the wolf knuckles off the screen man go put some lotion on them jokes man Woo, man you got some back in the day 1970 knuckles man you like he got them fred sanford knuckles. he's got them fred sanford knuckles for real man you've been working on trucks all now nah, yeah you work for the wwe You've been <laughs> you've been knocking boys out with <laughs> them knuckles, man. No, <laughs> Jay Joe, my, I gotta, I gotta the, ask you a serious question. That's from the brutality days, the knuckles. I, I want to ask you a serious question, bro, because like we joke and laugh and clown you about how many watches you buy. But Sir. what what is your number one inspiration you would say for the watches that you get? And now you, you said you 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 like divers more than anything, but like what inspires you to buy the watches that you get? What expired? What inspires me? Yeah. If I see something that I like, 
mm-hmm. it's affordable to my price range, I'm going to buy it. Okay. I'm going to buy it. With or without the Invicta Store coupon. Okay. With or without Shop HQ coupon. With or without if I go to Invicta Store, if I like it, if it's in my price range, I'm going to get it. There's no there's no if with Jay Jones. There's no ifs in those conversations. Well, I want to know this. Like, would you would you consider would you consider a watch at the uh, the two thousand dollar or three thousand dollar price point, or have it? I've considered. I have a watch that I paid nine hundred dollars for, mm-hmm. but that was a couple years ago, and it's not even a victor. Okay. And I think you know it's that Elgin with the diamonds. Okay. 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 Well, I was I was just curious because this this is one of the the, the topics that you know we were we were talking about. Um, it's like, do you feel the need? Because you look at YouTube, you see all these things that, that you know advertised. You've seen watches that I've shown. I've been to multiple yeah, been to stores. Show. I, I I paid a couple watches five hundred dollars. Okay. I've paid a couple watches fourteen ninety nine. Okay. The the Digitex, they're fourteen ninety nine. Yep. So I mean, if it's if it's on sale or like, so your I think what did you tell me last week? Um, what was your comf- comfortable? You comfortable spending three? Three. Three. Okay. Okay. So about three hundred dollars. You 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 good to go around that? Um. Mm-hmm. Uh, so all right, all right. I just want to know. Like, I'm just kind of asking questions, Vic. I'm comfortable. Yeah. Doing. I'm comfortable doing three, but if it's something I really want and it's more than three, I'll get it. Okay. 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 Well, let me ask you this: Is there is there an expensive piece out there that you've looked at that you've considered lately? Yeah. Oh, what what are we talking? Tudor. Yeah. Yeah. There was there was an Invicta. Oh, it was Invicta with diamonds. Okay. With the uh, like the like the triangle shape. Oh yeah 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 that's it, the, was that the speedway speedway. The speedway. Yeah. The listen, just, was it eight ninety nine or something like that? Listen, just don't buy that junk gladiator that Joe's got. That costs ten cents. Don't get that one. Eight ninety nine. Why get the one back? <laughs> Joe, ten cents to get the run. Was it <laughs> Joe? Was it ten yeah. cents or was, or was it a dollar ninety nine plus? No, it was ten cents. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got a deal. What a joke! I I messed with trap earlier and people didn't realize. I got a couple older. Remember the dollar ninety nine cent? What's it? Dollar ninety nine cent TV show they had on for a while. No. All right. How about the Gone Show? Oh, yeah. we got one love in here. I got text one love. I'll watch it today after this. Okay. Well, he did. He did. He did a show also called the Dollar Ninety Nine Cent Show or something like that. I can't. I, I can't remember exactly when it was on. It was on around the same time the Gone Show. You You're talking about the host Chuck Barris? Yeah, the whole Chuck Berry stuff. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You look up some of his old stuff, Chuck. He he was a he was a joke. But that's why I said the trap. I said I'll buy the dollar for a dollar nine a watch for a dollar ninety nine. <laughs> was Jay, was the gong show the one the guy come out with the paper bag on his head? Yeah. Uh, the, the yeah, yeah. Comic, yeah. <laughs> so uh oh, yeah, the so unknown comic, yep. So I'm gonna so be Vic, I'm gonna start putting yeah. I'm gonna start putting Joe. I'm gonna start putting a bag over my face to the unknown. And, and, and I'm gonna put, put a muzzle on your face. I'm talking yeah. to Vic. <laughs> well, I'm talking to Joe. I don't care about that. <laughs> hey, we been, now who do you rock? I don't care what you say. Man, hope you, hey, you do realize I have mute, I have mute features on here. I can mute <laughs> hey, I got I got one even better. I can there's a button on oh <laughs> Done. Put the shut to the up. <laughs> <laughs> wow. No, that's funny. You know just, for that, just for that. Good night, guys. <laughs> good night, guys. I will talk to you guys later. <laughs> Trap. I'm getting in my. I'm getting to the airport, and I'm flying to your city. You don't. You don't know where I live at. Oh yes, I do. Oh, I have you know. your address. You don't no. re- remember. 
I sent you stuff out there. I have your address. I, I moved. I moved. No, you didn't. <laughs> you lie and you lie like a rug. California. And you lie like a rug. It don't matter. You'll never know. Listen, <laughs> if you get off this live, I will not be here by the time you fly here. Now, how about that? Yeah. <laughs> oh, you yeah? forget. I got a go bag, baby. I'll be about here. <laughs> oh, I know you are back and you'll be over here. Did you know, I come in the wrong time? No, we we clown it. We clown it. Uh, Vic. Who's, yes, sir. Who, who, who's asking if you came in the wrong you time? Talked, uh, we've talked about a number of watches and how yep. you, you collect and stuff like that. And it uh, has come to my attention that there was a particular um, expensive watch that you had your eye on. Yep. And could you uh, please elaborate and share with the class sure. what you had your eye on? Well, again, I'm going to go back to two and a half weeks ago now, and I wish I was there now, but um, on our latest Florida trip, I stopped at a store called Luxury of Time. Oh, I heard about it. Um, <laughs> more, more, than, more than once. And um, <laughs> I, had a, uh, I had a Breitling in my hand, mm. and I was this close to getting it. Um, I Instagrammed Trap. I made a video call. Thank God he didn't answer because he did and told me, yes, that's a good deal. I would have picked up my first Breitling. Um, it would have been about, he would have given me a little bit of a break. I probably would have got it for about $4,600, no taxes, three-year warranty. Um, I got approved for their store card right away, but uh, I didn't jump. I didn't jump on it, but I was this close to getting my watch of my dreams, but didn't happen. How much did you say it was, Vic? It was five, but because I'm out of state, I wouldn't have to pay taxes, and he was going to give me like a couple hundred dollars off, a three-year warranty with it, and um, their own store credit card, you know, so I can get approved. Yeah. And yeah, you know, but if I Instagram called Trap, but Trap was in in Minnesota doing his thing. If Trap would have said, "Yo, Vic, you got to get that piece," I'd be wearing it right now. So are you saying thank God that he didn't, or you wish he I'm, did? I'm saying thank God he didn't, <laughs> because <laughs> because I would have got it. I would have got it. It was a That's beautiful. That's why the trap is the biggest enabler in the world. It was beautiful, trap man. If it trap was says it, we do it. Which Breitling was it, Vic? Um, the Ocean um, series, I think. I don't Ocean know the exact series? name of it. It was I'll a blue strap. Knows. Yep, it was a blue strap. It had that. The system where once you set the strap to your size, it lit, it closed automatically with the, with the clasp. You didn't have to adjust it anymore. Yeah. Um, it was a beautiful white dial, clean, with a blue uh, real stat. Oh, my. Rehot, I mean. Yeah. Oh, man, it was gorgeous. Gorgeous. And There's got uh, to be a side of you that says, I wish you did answer, too, though. Right? There is, yeah, there is. There is. <laughs> yeah. There is. Because that's my dream watch. You know, yeah. that's my dream watch. So. And, you know. and, and I respect that, bro, because like y'all. So, ladies and gentlemen, me, me and Vic talked about that uh, for a couple of days, actually. And then I went to an event and uh, it wasn't the same watch that he had, but, you know, it was similar. And uh, I, I was saying time. I know he'll get that watch in time. But the one thing that I, I do respect about Vic is with his love for Magnums and the way he collects, man, he's passionate about it, you know, and he. Don't question it. And Joe, you the same way. You know, uh, you walked us around your room last week. And, uh, dude, I I respect the way you guys collect. You know, I, I'm, like, fired up about it because you got to see Joe and Vic and even Jay Jones. Like, all you guys have given watches to other people. You have sent stuff to other collectors. You know what I'm saying? And uh -huh. it's, not, it's not like you're just so in love with the watch to where you kind of alienate people and you don't want to share this, this, this passion with other people uh, that, I mean, I just respect that, you know, I yeah. respect that. However, mm -hmm. however, uh, there are some people that that's not going to happen with. And we've talked about this so much. Uh, there are a, a, a number of comments that's going to come your way to where you just like kind of just brush that to the side. Uh, but I'm curious about, the people that can go over to one of the big channels, listen to the, the stuff that's being spewed out and take that as being reality right. and then go forward yeah. with it. Because, you know, nowadays, 
people people talk a good game and they can say some stuff, man. You never know how somebody may respond to your negativity. Right. You know? yeah. Like, what are we animals out here? What what you you you're threatening? I'm like, hey, look, man. I I didn't watch this one, but uh there was uh there was uh um a YouTube video saying that a, a YouTuber got kidnapped. Don't know what happened, but during COVID, there were YouTubers that was talking crazy online, and they got caught up. There's a whole tray of videos out there that shows YouTubers that have. I think it was called YouTube. When YouTube goes wrong or something crazy, people are getting beat up out there in the street because you're talking smack and you sharing your location, or they may know. Like, hey, I know that landmark. And you keep talking junk, I'm coming to where you are. And that happens, man. I'm like, and I will hate for something to happen to you, to anybody, because it's it's bigger than just saying, hey, you know, I don't like that watch. You start yeah. to show people Crazy. that right there. I'm like, yeah, what are we doing? Exactly. What are we it's doing? This watch collecting, right? It, before, it. before you said that, I was just going to say the same thing. It's like, you pissed the wrong person off. They're going to come find you. You know what I mean? <laughs> In that's this, this, what's happening. What's I mean, look, crazy. you piss them off, they'll leave, go get what they got, and then come back to get you. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> that that's why probably, we're probably true with DK. Okay, Mr. Ball. 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 Degenerate. Wow, probably I true. <laughs> but hey, you know, man, it just I, no, you're you're I mean, not an outcast, bro. No, you dad, know? you're not an outcast either, dad. No, 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 no. Man, that's funny. Hey, is, Joe, <laughs> is Joe wearing his Bruin Bruin jacket there? Come on, Joe. Bruin sweatshirt, yeah. Come on, I want the Rangers on. Well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Thing, I, hey, I, could, hey, I couldn't wear team. this. I couldn't wear this last year. It didn't fit. <laughs> num- was it the number one? Well, that's number a good one thing, team. Greg. Number one yeah. team. What is it? Well, number Boston? one. Boston. Um, well, look. Just to break away from watch for a second, I don't want the president's trophy. Joe can have it. Yeah, no, I don't want it either. Not after last year. <laughs> that's the biggest, <laughs> the biggest jinx in sports is that president's trophy, man. Yeah, because get the president's trophy, don't win. Three, hey, look, hockey's been around since 1926. Mm-hmm. The team that's finished first overall, only three times they've won the Stanley Cup. Now, one of those times it was the Rangers in '94, mm-hmm. and that was because of Messier and everybody else. Mm-hmm. So, that's a trophy's a jinx. Man. Yeah. Anyway, back to watches. Uh, so we got we got uh the degenerate in the uh in the chat. Yeah, we and do. He has yes. a, a number of that degenerate boy. Yeah, he has a number of, of of spicy watches, controversial watches, and you know the thing about DK. And he's a conspirator too. We got the conspirator here in the chat with us. He's another conspirator. Who's that? DK. He conspired. He conspired with trapping my wife. Got me my birthday present last year. Oh, I know about all that. Oh yeah. Nah. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Mm. So I mean, my 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 thing is this, man. So DK has a collection that if somebody, I mean, if they came for him, I know he don't care because he's gonna say something like crazy uh, to them. However, his collection is so diversified, but like it really, it really don't matter, man. It's like it's almost like you have to justify being a watch collector now. If if, if you have like for me. And for you guys, they got Invicta collection of uh, Invicta in your collection. It's almost like you have to justify, like, well, okay, yeah, I got Invicta, but I have, I got a G Shock, and oh, 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 and I got, man, please, bro. I know what? people within the Invicta community or universe that that's all they got is Invicta timepieces. That's all they want. It's pretty Invicta much me. Timepieces. I mean, besides my seven Aragons, I don't count my Disney pieces. That's that's me in a nutshell, and I don't care. I don't Period. care either. You know, I don't care I, either. I, I, you know, and it, it, it don't, it, it does not matter um, how these people feel. Though I do understand because I've talked and I've said this. You guys can go back and see like some of my lives where I've talked about uh, the different things that that come up. I've talked to people that say, "Hey, you know what? I, I, I hate." that people are coming for me for this particular thing. It just makes me sick. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I almost don't want to post anymore because these people got something to say. And that made me feel like, man, dude, you shouldn't be, 
you should not feel any type of way about the watches that okay mom the type of watches that you bought i'm like what is what is the problem with i don't i don't know i don't know and and i was listening to cliff say this earlier he said well you have to ignore those comments i said man look put it like this i delete the worst comments the racist comments and the, the very nasty ones i delete those I know uh, DK will keep them and pin them. I know he'll keep and pin all those those negative comments and put those people on blast. But I, you know, I, I don't want somebody to come to my channel and look at the comment section and be like, "Good grief, what's going on over here?" You know, oh, yeah. and, you know, they be having a bad day. I don't want them to have to see that negative crap. You know, and I know, um, I just saw a comment. Hold up, man. I got I got to point this out. If y'all watch this on replay. Uh, the women, <coughs> they, 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 oh boy, we we yeah, they, they don't. We're, yeah, okay, we're, we're, yeah, okay. That sounds like me saying I'm not buying anymore. Come yeah, on, Dave okay. D. Come on, Dave D. What are we talking about here? What, what are we Dave talking D about? I don't collect anymore. Yeah, not maybe for month, maybe for the month of March. Well, see, <sighs> I'm not buying any more watches this month. Bro, you only got a couple more hours in the month, bro. What are you talking about? Get out of here, bro. Put yourself in time out. <laughs> so big. Yeah. That, that's the watch. I don't know if you can see it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah. That's the one you got? That's the one I got coming in, yeah. It's nice. Boy, I wish I had the, had, had Joe's collection. <laughs> here we go. I burned mine. <laughs> Check that, offers? Joe. I see you. So many different styles, no need to say me up, Jerry. Hey Joe. Yeah. That's, I don't care because you know what? I love my collection. I love I mine do. too. I love my collection. I love your collection also. I wouldn't have them if I didn't want them and like them, you know. Well, that's what I'm saying. I buy what I want and what I like. Trap yeah. like, we, like we said before. If I can get a sale, I get a sale. If I don't, hey, I get it. What the heck? Okay. But I can't be like Vic. I can't be like Vic because I, I I don't I, I don't know how to get all the magnums. You don't know how yeah. to get them. Yeah, I don't know how to get magnums. Hey, I don't want to be called. A hey, that took a while, man. I don't want to be called Magnum Vic Junior. You have to wait there, bro. You have to there, bro. You still thinking about the Brian May Vic? Yeah, I got to talk to Jacob about that. Trap was gonna uh, talk to him, but he was away, so I think he's back now. Yeah, he's yeah, back. Yeah, I texted him yesterday. I see. I'll yeah. see him tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. I see him. Tomorrow. I'll, I'll I'll definitely watch get it. Get yeah. tomorrow, trap. It's April Fool's Day. You fool. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> April Fool's hey, Day. Hey, man, hold up, man. Listen, listen, man. I'm gonna tell you like this. Man. Uh, <laughs> almost, you guys are gonna have to acknowledge me as being the uh, upcoming and the best collector ever, man. So, uh, trap, go ahead and let them know that I'm coming through, man. Uh, yeah, Fool's man, it's your boy. Man. What's up? I'm leaving. Did y'all think? Did y'all think? Did y'all think I wasn't gonna show up? Bye. Goodbye. We'll see you. We'll see you. We'll see you. Adios. Hey, calle de la boca por de. What? You better watch. I said calle de la boca. No, I'm not putting any look. Hey, I know Italian. That's close to Italian. I'm gonna keep my mouth shut with you. You're my bro. <laughs> What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? How's it going, Felix? Uh, going good, man. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. Just uh, just got finished doing my last few trips uh, out the airport, yeah. and I take them to this uh, hotel. So I figure, let me park real quick and join in the convo. So what's up? We didn't ask you to come in here. I I, I know. I didn't yeah, ask Dave, you to be here. Man. Yo, Trap, me and you got to call Dave D on the three way later on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so let me, let's let's kick it let's kick it like this, man. So watches. Feel it how uh, you doing? Vic, I don't know when the last. I'm doing good, Jerry, uh, brother. You know I love you. I love you too, Vic. Let Let me start. You with too, Vic. You too, Vic. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Chad. Let me get let me get all the love out. You okay, too, Vic. Yo, <laughs> <laughs> we go way back. We go way back. Trap, man. You looking dapper? You looking dapper, Trap? I like wait, it. Wait a minute. You know what? I'm looking so dapper. I need somebody to take a picture of me, man. So I know only one person in the world that can take the best photographs on this planet. 
You see him on cruises. You see him at barbecues, man. So please welcome to the stage, man. The Godfather. Godfather. Oh, oh. You're not worthy. You're not worthy. You know what? You know what? When I can come on and the Godfather follows me up, man, that, that's a good day. That's a good day. What's up? What's up, Godfather? What's up, Glenn? Hey, hey, just, just taking it easy, man. Relaxing, watching the show and stuff like that. So you know what? Let me stop in for a little bit, you know, just to you know, even things out here. You know, I, I don't like thank you, man. Cars. Thank you. We need well, six people numbers. up there and stuff like that. You know, I, I like numbers. even numbers, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> now it's a show, man. GF is here. Now it's a show. <laughs> Godfather, let me say this. Your post today for yep. for uh, Easter. Yeah. Beautiful, man. Thank you. Man. Beautiful, man. Hard. Beautiful, man. Yeah. Great job. Beautiful, man. Great job. Dave, you said he's not answering his phone. <laughs> Hey man, so so uh I want to ask I, I want to start with Joe. Uh we know what you like the most of. But I'll ask you this, out of the last 5 purchases that you made, what was your, your the, the number one purchase out of the last 5 that you have Oof. in your collection right now? Tough What's question. question. I'm going to say probably the Brian May one. Oh. Oh okay. man, we, let's that get a closer nice for that. You got it nearby? Yeah, you want it? Yeah, oh yeah, let me get it. Yeah, my tantalize me a little bit for tomorrow. Hold on. Mm. That's a tough question, man. Mm. It is. Mine hasn't come in yet. Of course it is for no, you, Jay. No, you have, have, have to have it. You have no. to have it. It's gotta be in your possession. Oh, you have, you have to have it. It came in this nice case too. Uh here. Yeah, look at that. Case. Yeah, look at that. Hold on. I get it out of the box. I mean, everybody know who, who Brian May is, right? That we're talking. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. Oh, let me let me turn my. Let me see, let me see a minute. Nice. Yeah, nice. Nice. Either. Let me see something. Let me the catch reason, that. The reason I say that. Going to my corner. The reason I say that is because of the history behind the band and the, and it kind of <laughs> relates to the watch, because he made. He made his first guitar with his father. Yeah, it was, that's called, it was called the Red Special. Yep, and that's what that's this the, watch is, is dedicated to. Yep, and that's the design of the watch is supposedly yep. his. That's got to be his guitar. Yep. Mm -hmm. his I mean, who doesn't like Queen? Music. Come on, how can you not I, like I, one I, Queen song? You know what I mean? Come on. Oh my, yeah, they're 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 one of the best bands ever, man. Yeah, come on. And he still so, uses that guitar today. But that's a okay. tough question, man. Five watches. That's a tough question. All right, Trapple, you know what? You're doing let's put it back to you, man. You you fought a lot lately. Give give us your top five. Can you? Can you even do that? You like you're like Dave D. You guys are one one connected. I thought he said top one. Yeah, no, he said five. Uh, the last five you bought, what's the best one? Is what he asked. That that's right what there. the last five you bought, what's the best one? That oh, one right the best, there. Okay, the best one out of the five. Oh, okay. Yep, yeah, that one. That one got that the Zanea. Um, the the more the more I look at it. Hold on, let me see. Who do we lose? You lose Felix. 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 Oh, he probably had to do a run. Um, I'll I'll say that one is like it's so dynamic. It's like the more you look at it, the more details you start seeing, and it's like man, it's crazy, man. Like when you really get to study it. Um, but I will say that one is. Like dead set, like the best one, and yo, know, I'll just say that that's that's the best one right now. Okay, um, I'll say as of right now, it might be this one. Mm. Glycine, glycine. That? That's the glycine that that uh. With the brown. Uh, yeah, yeah. It would, be, would be interchangeable strap. With the interchangeable right now, that might be the one. The, the Jerry, is that, is, that, is that one of the five elements ones? Yes, it is. Okay. The brown, yeah, five elements collection. It's the uh it's it's <laughs> the box is beautiful, man. Look at that. Look at that box. You know that you know that was Trap's idea, right? Look at that box. What, what you guys what, didn't know? What the glycine? Well, no, oh. I said the that inspiration, I the inspiration behind yeah. the elements. Here's, yeah, the here elements, yeah. on my wrist, okay? Now, I've always gone for the bigger watches, but I love the way that looks. It's yeah. not too small, you know? Yeah, no, I mean, I'm still the same way. I mean, it's only a, 
I tried it out. It's only a 41 millimeter, but right now, and I like the color because I don't have that much, the brown with the gold. And then, you, like I said, if I want to change the band to the brown silicone band, that's I, I like that one. I like that one right now. So that of so the, so the last, last five, five that's, that's yours. Okay. That, of the last five that came in, out of okay. the seven and a half, yeah, that's the so, one. So Godfather, I gotta I gotta know, man, which the last five that you got, man? Which this? What's your favorite out of the last five? Um, well, that's definitely a tough one because the last five I bought were the ones right before the cruise. So I'm gonna have to. If I have to choose, it would be the uh, Reserve Grand Diver with the Meteorite dial, the uh, Masterpiece Edition. Ooh, with wow. the 7750 in it. Mm, mm, yeah. Mm. So, yeah. I mean, I bought that one. I bought the Sandblasted one, the Malachite with the 2824, the Tiger's Eye with the 2824. So, I mean, those were like the last ones I bought. So, if I had to pick one out of that group, it would be the. Uh, Meteorite with the uh, 7750. So I was wearing today, Godfather. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. And you know, you know, Godfather, you're the reason why I got the Tiger's Eye because you had, like, you showed me that I was like, yeah, oh, yeah that, I got eye. Mm. that Grand Diver Tiger's Eye is a bomb. That thing bomb. is stupid, man. It's a bomb. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, that, 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 Ryan had got both the, he got both the Tiger's Eye and the Malachite. Yeah, I got them both too. I got them both too. I love the tiger yeah, design. Too. That's awesome. It is awesome. I got oh, you got both. Okay, hold up. Oh, I got you, bro. Uh, he said he got disconnected. I thought you was on a run. Okay, hey y'all. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, T White said nice. So you get some, huh? Okay. Hey, uh, JR, thanks, thanks for the compliment, JR. JR says that I need to be on Shop HQ more often because uh, I will be, I'd be all dressed up. <laughs> I have a question, guys. What's up? I saw, I was looking on um, Invicta stores today and they had a um, Invicta Cruise Line, Swiss Ronda 760. Is that is that one from one of the cruises or what is that? With a Z, with a Z sixty in it, yeah, yeah. Okay, so the cruise line watches. What they do is, what for what ship is that one? I that's what I can't tell. It doesn't tell me. It doesn't go to specifications. He won't tell you. No, I already tried it. No, because the people that put it on there don't give the full detail of it. So you, it'll be a surprise once you get it. Because, but, God, but Godfather, don't you get a watch on every cruise ship? Yeah, I, I get the cruise lines on the cruise ship. Now they do have the right. and the automatics, and I always go for the uh, automatics. The very first one, the very first two that I bought when I was on cruise ships and I discovered them were quartz. And then that's when I started going with the uh, automatics and stuff like that because I just got tired of changing batteries and stuff. Hey Joe, if you order, still try the X twenty. What's that? Right. Try the X twenty on the <laughs> store still. Well, it got now, that's, that's unusual that it's not telling you which ship it's from. And usually, if you got if you got other pictures of it, or basically if that's in stores, get the model number, go to Invicta Watch, put the model number in there, and there it should probably give you pictures of the back so that you can turn around and be able to see which ship it is from. Yeah. I'm going to do it right now. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I watch. So, where, where, where was we at? You was asking everybody's last five watches. It's so you were about to say goodbye when you came back. So, yeah, your 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 last five watches. What is the number one out of the oh. five? Uh, my jailbreak. My jailbreak. I'm not at home, so I, I I'm not able to show it to you. But my jailbreak. Uh, Trap, you've seen it. Uh, Joe, you've seen it. Uh, Jerry, you've seen it. Uh huh. Um, uh, uh, Godfather, I'm sorry I hadn't sent it to you, but you know what a jailbreak is, obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, it'll, it'll it'll be the jail. It's a jailbreak. I mean, and and for the price I got it and who I got it from, yeah, it, it's 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 pretty nice. Pretty, and it's my one and only jailbreak. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So, definitely nice. 
And you know what's crazy is that that's one of those things where uh, if you're an Invicta collector, I know all of us have thought it or or, or complained about it, uh, wanting to see more of the old school pieces come back. Now, I do know yeah. that they just dropped the Sabaco Normal 1 is actually back on Invicta stores right now with the 7750. Mm -hmm. So if you guys, well, it's, it's set uh, $1,000 pretty much. Mm -hmm. But I believe that code, what he just said, X20 will still work on it, which will drop, knock it down to 800 or whatever. Yes. Well, as of as of yes, as of this morning, X twenty was still working. Anyway. What is, what does it say on there? Carnival? What? I don't even see it, it say Carnival. Oh, okay. yeah, it, it 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 doesn't. Yeah, it, it, it should. It should, but yeah, that that one doesn't. Is that one? Is, does that one show as a numbered limited edition? It says uh, cruise line exclusive. Is what it says. Okay, but see. They they have watches on the cruise ship, okay, and then they have some that actually has the cruise ship's name on it, and those are numbered limited edition. It's limited yeah, to the length of the ship. Okay, that's okay. what I originally thought this was, but it isn't. Yeah, yeah. Hey, Godfather, are you able to get those watches anywhere or just on the cruise ship? Sometimes you can find them in Invicta stores. Okay, it's very rare, but you can find them in Invicta stores and stuff like that. I right. like getting them on the ship itself because that just makes it a little right. bit more exclusive. Yeah. So, yeah. Sure, so sure, sure. Place, yeah. on, on Godfathers, the only reason you'll find them in Invicta stores that actually came from uh, during COVID when they finally brought those ships. Correct. They they offloaded all of those ships of all the merchandise and they flooded it back to the Invicta store. So Correct. there are some, some of those ships, uh, those cruise lines in circulation yeah, and that's the only reason why you'll see that. Normally, uh, because I've actually talked to and I think it's Natalia, the way the marketer uh, she works directly with uh, AL, mm -hmm. they purposely put those on the ship for the for that ship. You won't see them nowhere else, correct? I mean, I found a, a couple of the ships that I've been on that I bought you know watches off the ships, seen them in uh Invicta stores, but like they didn't have that that many stuff, but I had already had mine and everything, you know. Now, there's a couple of ships that I've been on that um, during the time I was there on the ship, they didn't have the particular model that I was looking for. So of course I am looking for that for when it shows up in stores and stuff like that. So if it shows up, then I'm gonna get it because I've been on the ship, you know. Cool, cool. I think there's so, only like one or two. I wanna, so. um, I wanna let you guys know, uh, we got some stuff coming up with uh, 757. Right. Uh, and if you guys haven't signed up for the cruise, man, just reach out to me, hit my email and uh, I'll give you further information on the cruise. But after after uh, so Invicta 757 is having their fifth anniversary, I'll be there. I know a number of you guys have been invited to it at when I come back. Uh, I am working with Kokomo Watch Company. So there are watches that I will be able to get to you guys at a discounted price. Um and it'd be reasonable, all right? But I will drop, there will be an actual website for you guys to go on to actually utilize this. But just mm -hmm. want to give you guys a heads up. I've talked to, i reached out to a couple of you guys privately about some stuff before this kicks off. But uh, I'll be working with Kokomo Watch Company um, in about three weeks from now. Well, I'm working with them now, but like in three weeks, you guys will start seeing it. It'll actually be in a bar underneath. So when you're looking at videos, you'll see the website you'll be able to go right. to. <laughs> So yeah, that will be coming, but I, and I'm excited cool. about that man because you guys will get to see some stuff. And if you need like a up close and personal, you know how like you go on the website and you look and see like, yeah, man, I, I would like to see this watch in motion. I'll feature the watch right here on the channel. I'll I'll feature the watch, and I'm not gonna do it in a short. I'll make it a, a two minute video run through of of the actual watch. So right. if you have any questions, and these watches come with the warranties and stuff like that. So. <laughs> You all right, Joe? Yeah, yeah. Joe, you all right, buddy? <laughs> you sound like you're to cough up yeah, my throat. I, I, I got your address now. I'll send somebody over there now. <laughs> He's coughing up a lung and stuff, man. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. I hey, you know what? Hey, Godfather, that's a literal thing. My my son coughed up. He well, he coughed so hard where he punctured his lung. And it, yeah. it had a little hole in his, in his lung, but it, that's a real thing. You can hey, actually bro, cough up a I, lung, I, yeah. I, 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 
like bruise Yo, my ribs make- before. That that's that's not fun. I can tell you that that hurts. No, oh no, no, no. And, and chat, you know, it's funny. Well, it's not funny, but what was weird about it when we took him to the hospital? First, we took him to the doctor, and the doctor said, "No, you got to take him to the emergency room." And when we got to the emergency room, you know, a lot of times you go to the emergency room. Sometimes you can sit there for an hour, two hours, three hours. We didn't sit there for 20 minutes. So it was an important sure. thing. How and, many hours? Um, and uh, that, I mean, you ain't never been in an emergency room where you sit there for an hour, two hours. You know, me? I mean, I have. I mean, me? anybody. I was six and a half hours before they saw me. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was, I was being nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, hey, but anyway, I mean, we went there 20 minutes. They called him back. And uh, I mean, he's all right. It was all right. He was all right. But in his neck there, because of the punctured lung and his breathing, he uh, on, the, on the side of his neck felt like kind of best way to explain it was like Rice Krispie treats. You know, his, his neck right here felt it was just bubbly. Mm. bubbly because of the oxygen going in his lungs and coming out of his breath, him trying to breathe. And, the, you know, and, and the doctor like, Hey, feel this. I was like, you know, I kind of like, Oh man, it, it felt weird. So oh. coughing up a lung is a real thing and it ain't no joke. You know, so, man. so Joe, you okay, Joe, you okay. <laughs> I'm good. All right, brother. Yeah, Joe, I can't get there quick enough to do CPR on you, man. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. I was coughing I'm Thanks sure we can get somebody sure. there. <laughs> All right. So, ladies and gentlemen, let me see. We are hour and six minutes in, and uh, we will uh, end it there. Now, again, if you guys want to come and showcase your, your watches, I want to have an open forum today, and I had the best in the business to actually come up here and, and, and showcase their faces, Godfather being the first. Stupid face, Godfather. No, <laughs> no, but like, I, I appreciate you guys taking the time out to uh to come in and you know what I'm saying, just rap and kind of get to uh. Let me see. Glad he made it through. Okay, yeah, yeah. That's T White. T White, man. Everybody, T White still watching. Appreciate you, bro. Only White. Yeah. So um, we'll we'll conclude this. We'll start something else next week. Vic, man, you got to talk about two bros in the watch. We'll yep. have that coming up. But if you yep. guys want to participate on Instagram, showcasing your watches that that inspired by somebody, or you right. received it from somebody, or even if your grandmother or whoever left right. it to you, we'll be doing and, that. And, and trap, join us, join us. And trap, you know I'm gonna holler at you tomorrow. You know what what comes in tomorrow? I'll holler yeah, at yeah, you yeah, when yeah. it comes okay. in. Yeah. And uh, yeah. And, and yeah, so good stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Them, man, if you you be careful the next day. So you gotta right, be careful right. tomorrow. <laughs> so with that being said, man, we're gonna end it right there. And uh you guys got anything positive to say before we leave? Yeah, you guys be careful tomorrow. Remember, it's April Fool's Day. And we That's got right. six fools, we got six <laughs> fools up here on the panel right now. So you fools, <laughs> you fools. I'm, I'm gonna stay my butt home. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you man, I got a hey, you fools be the careful. Big, the biggest fool is right there, okay. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that's, hey, Godfather, that's awesome. <laughs> that one there? Talk about trap? Yeah, look at that. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Yeah. 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 No, you, no uh, Jerry, you was pouring the Vic on my screen. Hey, <laughs> top, hey, hey top. it's not unusual to be loved by anyone. And with that, uh, uh, thank y'all for coming cut out. It, cut Appreciate it. Y'all. And uh, until the next Vic, strike, y'all. You're my best friend. How about you? <laughs>